Hey guys, welcome back to Pixel Lodge. I found an elevator in the basement and uh, it's flooded. We don't want to. <laughs> oh, geez, what a crap. It was an old boss. So I thought bosses traditionally died and didn't come back. Well, they're called flexible sentries, so they were created by whoever created them to be douchebags. A, uh, a very troubled young man. Or old. So it's gonna take me a minute to fucking fight this fucker. So I mean, I may make this episode go a little bit over. Well, we can find a fast forward button. Well, well, you can't find a fast forward button. Can this boss just assume that because he can't get to the doorway, he'll die? Wouldn't that be some shit? <laughs> I mean, the mummies gave up in a general apathetic way. I don't see why the bosses can't. I wish they could. I wish they could. But alas. He appears to have someone glued to his back. That's that's what they're called. They're called flexible sentries. So ah. they're actually one person with a hideous deformity. Mm -hmm. Their knees actually bend the other way. Oh shit! Name it, Daniel. <laughs> yeah, I get that a lot. Distracting me and shit. Oh. Yep. Four twenty, blaze it. So this used to be a boss, and now it's just a normal enemy you encounter? Yeah. In so a, in a, a very annoying enemy. So we can look forward to encountering some brass entries later. Yep. Or whatever they're called. Actually, much later. Oh, bollocks. You don't see them until... Oh, would you come back here? I'm not done with you yet. Well, he's figured that he can't kill you, so the ADD is dead, you know. <laughs> Just, you know, water splashy noises are amusing. Come on then. Come up here. Fight me, nerd. The reason I don't want to fight him down there is because water makes you slower. But not him. But not him. He's got backwards knees, and it's known for being an excellent water waiting skill. Water waiting. I just wish he would die. I'm, I'm, in, I'm amused that his lower half is uh, covered in armor, and his shoulders are, and he's got a bucket on his head, but, uh... And the other guy on the, on the back of him actually has, like, full armor on. Yeah, this guy's chest is kind of exposed, mm -hmm. though. <laughs> so, let's say you ran away and came back, but you didn't touch a bonfire. Would this help you the same? I believe so. I'm not really willing to test it. No, that would, uh... That would be... So I may just go down there and swing my sword at him in a minute. Give him an honorable death. Ish. There we go. There we go. Now you loot his body and take his sword. Oh, nope. Actually, I already have his sword. The, the, uh, the curved blade oh. is the sword that I wanted. And how long ago was the boss fight that got you that? Um, well, I just traded in his, his, his boss soul. For it, I'm gonna go back to. So it's like Pokemon, where you put the fossil in the machine and you get something out. Yeah, pretty much. Nice. So I'm gonna spend the next couple minutes clearing this area. What do we have at the end of this river of woe? And uh, there's a boss room at the end. River of apathy. Water flows, but my spirit does not. What? Yes, that was a bug. To see if there's like a, a a room there. So there's a there's a summon sign here that we're gonna use. Where? Right there. Ah, oh, I see. I thought that was another message. So do you get to pick who you summon, or is it area specific? Area specific. Uh, Luca Teal is the one that I'm most interested in finishing her storyline with. And then you get her as a Pokemon? Effectively. Nice. Hey, Mr. Buddy. I'm just, I'm just coming by. Just gonna, just gonna, just gonna pick this up. No need to, no need to get up. No need to move. Um, can I, can I get you anything? No? no? Okay, I'm, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to. I think he's napping. And I need to, come on. Whoosh! Having a rave there? Fuck! So, question. Uh, 
you gonna have to fight that boss again now? No. Well, that's good. Just had to find your way back and uh, slosh through some water. I shouldn't have just jumped down. I should have done it, took it one room at a time. Motherfuckers. Are you my mummy? Stupid. So bad. Yo. What do you think of as a big present waiting for you? Just don't die on the way or it gets sent back to the store. Oh look, you figured it out! I'm actually kind of impressed. He's a smart guy. That's why he needs to be put down. <laughs> oh, that was annoying. Watch. Is he gonna walk? Oh, did he there? not fucking do it? Oh, you wanted him to walk down the hole? Yeah, I was like, I was expecting him to do it because he didn't last time I fought him, and the thing was open. They're learning, Randall. After six playthroughs, they finally. Oof! Oh, look, an item. Did I miss that last time? Is he glued to the stairs? I guess so. Okay, so my, my thing is I need to make sure that I don't fall through the hole. You don't have the uh, boots of feather falling? No. I didn't, I didn't in a... <clears throat> Use your words. TDO when I play, I'm actually kind of hungry. I might have to take a minute, like a break in a second. There's some souls downstairs in the kitchen. There's some what? Oh, there's a leftover Chinese food. Those aren't very filling souls. You're uh, hungry for a more uh, victim. Talk to a little while. Do to do. Look at how pretty I am. Jesus. <laughs> You've uh. That makeup thing is gonna do wonders for you. You're gonna come out a new person. Um, no. Yeah. Probably not. But. Do you uh, do eyeshadow the same on a eyeless creature as you would a normal one? What is, what is this? Dead crossbow. Hmm. <laughs> as opposed to a living one. So yeah, see so it doesn't come back. OH SHIT IT DOES! <laughs> well, this, this episode is called, uh... <laughs> Randall uses lots of arrows and screams. <laughs> I, uh... I was wrong! <laughs> so we've got 366 arrows, correct? Yeah. <laughs> I, uh, let's, let's do some math. How many arrows does it take to kill... Lumpy and Stumpy? So nothing you can do to your arrows to make them pretty. Mm. Shiny and more better arrows. Come back and fight me, nerd. You're the nerd. You've been stuffing a locker here and just wailing on it. Oh, you fucking doucher. Ow. Ow. You need a spear, sir. Fuck this shit. <laughs> I was gonna try and fight him, you know, like a man. Nope. Now it's time to sh shoot him in the bucket repeatedly. Yep. See that fog gate over there? Yeah. There's a boss. So they put a boss in front of a boss? Yeah, I didn't realize they were gonna respawn. It's <laughs> some bullshit. Maybe when you beat the boss. Kind of. I've never actually died here. <laughs> I have good luck like that. Maybe that's, maybe that's why I didn't realize that he would just fucking come back. Do I have anything that can kill him? Just like straight up just fucking end him? What would that be? A, uh, what is this? A palm? Oh, there we go. We got some last. Wait, that's not what I meant to do. Well, you're gonna have to go get that with your souls too. Um, we're gonna go ahead and equip this. And. Damn it, Bobby. <laughs> This and That's how you name your equipment bag? This. Do you have some pocket sand? I feel like they'd go a long way. Where are you, where are you going? Fucker! 
Maybe a squirrel army. Hey, you know in the D&D game when you kept whipping? When you heard stuff? That's kind of weird. Ooh, ooh, ooh. What? Yep. <laughs> Jesus. I hope you know a dude that can hook you up with more of those, cause uh... <laughs> I just wish he would die. I know where you're at, you little fucking doucher. Maybe he's gotten smart. That's the last thing uh, Dark Souls needs is a learning capability. Uh, isn't that isn't that Elon Musk's like worst nightmare? The AI, Dark Souls AI, is come alive. Oh fuck! That's you didn't do that last time. Last already night. Cinder calls bleeding. There you go. Then you... I guess this is one way to clear out your inventory. Yeah. Woo. Unfortunately, you won't be able to retrieve any of those, will you? No. My realism... And the, uh, the magic has ended. Run! Before he kills me. Yeah, what are you gonna do now? Same thing he's been doing for the last 30 minutes. Secretly terrifying you. <laughs> it's not a secret. Well, I think we've used about, what? 45 arrows, 20 knives, oh. 4 fire bombs. But you know, the fucker's dead. Yeah, but I still got this fucker over here to worry about. Yep, you. Yeah, you. Talking about you. you dick. That guy was only worth like 3,000 souls. That's, that's a letdown from how long it took to kill him. Okay, now we come over here. There's one over here. I see you, little fucker. These guys are pretty pitiful after the big one. Where was the... There was a fourth one. Where did it go? Was that not four? Mm, I didn't see another one. Oh, look at Pharaoh's lockstone. Cool. Does that unlock the Pharaoh's door? Yeah. Pharaoh's. I'm also not sure how it's pronounced. Now you're, now you're questioning me on it. Let's, uh, let's go for. First. First? First. Ferris is. Ferris Bueller's Day Off? Ferris Bueller's Day Off. Except he can't get out because you took his key. So he's locked in there now. I didn't realize this was here either. Hm. Neat. You know what you should say, do you? Nope. I don't know why they would string a guy up with a shield either. Uh, Seems kind of counterintuitive. Well, maybe it was his family earlier in the day. I <coughs> yeah, felt bad for him. So, Not bad enough to let him down. Um, I'm going to go ahead and end this episode here. Yeah. Much, and uh, we'll come back and summon her and summon the other dude and then go and kill some bitches. Bye, guys. One shot. Bye.